Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back. In today's video update here for Gala, we are trading at 0 0.02502, 24 hour volume, we were down 10% and market cap, we were down 1.09%. Heading over to our daily time frame here, we can see the previous candlestick from yesterday, huge body compared to the previous body itself. So we know that we are going into heavy selling pressure into today too. As we can see, we are continuing our channel because we failed to break above our 23% of our FIB at the 2608 and our channel itself is a descending triangle. So again, we are most likely going to come down and retest this area of support at the zero. 0 0.02380 we can see here on November 21st and November 22nd these guys here have found support but we are most likely going to retest this area in the next couple of days or so heading over to immediate short term for two hours we saw this surge all of a sudden in the last couple of hours for gala coming up as 0 0.02599 definitely comment down below and let me know what created this huge surge of price or if there are whales manipulating the system or manipulating gala definitely let me know down below in the comments but last video we were kind of following our double top chart pattern and seeing if we were going to retest this area of support here at the 2503. As the price action came down, we actually saw this huge red candlestick as the progression of our MACD indicator actually grew even more. It didn't die down to hold on to the area of support. It actually grew the pressure as we saw the signal line and the MACD line grow further apart, strengthening that signal here. So now what we can see here with the MACD indicator is we can actually see that the progression actually led to a switch from our red over to our green near an area of support. However, we do see a few rejections around our 50 moving average and our 20 moving average, which is known as support and resistance area. And the more that we are getting rejected from it, the price may actually fall further away from it. Now, in the next couple of hours, we are going to be testing this area of resistance at 50% of our FIB at 2513 and our area of support here at 0 0.02. 2483 here. Now, with the progression of the MACD indicator, we may see consolidation. That basically means price is going to be moving around the resistance and coming down to an area of support and move around in a zigzag formation. Just because we are considered as an overbought here at 83%. Take a look at the reaction here of our K line and our D line. So our K line is the white line and our D line is the pink line here. If we do see the K line exceed upwards and come towards the right hand side of the D line itself, it's going to trigger a buying opportunity. Now the volume, if we take a look at the volume, if the price is gonna surge up along with our RSI, along with our MACD indicator, but the volume itself is low, the price action of this uptrend is not gonna be supported from the volume. So again, we're going to go into a consolidation phase. If the volume itself is supported with the uptrend with our RSI and our MACD indicator, then the price itself is going to be breaking through our area of resistance at 50% of our FIB chart. So that's kind of my outlook here for Gala. I do feel like we are going to be anticipating a consolidation before the actual breakout. If I do pull out the Bollinger Bands here, we can see that there is a minor squeeze here. And again, if we do get rejected from our 20 moving average, which is this yellow line here, essentially we are most likely going to break down and break out in a downwards or bearish market here for short term for two hours. So definitely let me know what you guys think down below in the comments, like and subscribe to the channel, but I'll see you next time.